Hi, this is Prayas and I'm a professional gambler. Today I will present to you the biggest pot ever played and this will be a few times bigger than the last one and this will be for mind-blowing 7.75 million dollars and yeah let's get warmed up for this by listening to some quotes from Tony G who will also be involved in the pot. The big heart. I have the big heart. I'm gonna take everything you have. Everything. When I kill them, I kill them. I destroy them. Destroy them. I love it. And you're gonna suffer so much. Oh, man. You will never wanna play poker again with me. Ever. This is a three handed 5k, 10k game on coin poker. Tony is on the button with Queen King Jack 3. He comes in for raise. This is a standard play given that he is in position and that they are very deep and that he can outmaneuver the other guys with his positional advantage. He might also be able to steal the blinds uncontested. Small blind also comes along. The big blind has a very beautiful looking hand, but in reality it's not as good as it looks. But this hand is still the bottom of his squeezing range. Hanimal squeezes and gets two callers. And the flop looks like a lot of fireworks as Hannibal hit top two with the nut flush draw and Tony G with the nuts the straight but no redraws at all. The standard play here is to bet but on the smaller side as you in general want to bet smaller on these lockdown type boards. Tony now should just call although he has the nuts. This is because so many cards change the board and the nuts on the turn and he wants to wait for a safe card first. He's looking for an equity shift in his favor against hands like he is facing with only one more card to come on the turn. Hannibal wouldn't mind to get it in right now as his hand does well against anything his opponent might have. Tony does the right thing and just calls. The 8 on the turn is a safe card but makes the bot even more draw heavy than before. Now things change quite a lot. With only one more card to come Hannibal now should check and call a bet, as he's not a favorite anymore against Tony's range if they get it in right now. If he had hearts instead of diamonds, he could bet again. Unfortunately, he makes a mistake and bets the full pot. It now is quite obvious that he is going nowhere. Tony's decision still is quite hard, I th at least I think so. This is because he has to also factor in the fact that his opponent might have the same hand as his but he could have multiple redraws or at least one redraw as well and Tony has no redraws at all. But with a pot to stack ratio of only 3.5 I think there's no other option than now is to stick it in and hope for the best. And that's what Tony does. And he probably is very happy to see that his opponent is overplaying his ace-queen. But can he hold or not? Amazing that they just run it once for that huge amount of money and yeah Tony holds and wins the biggest pot in online poker history 7.75 million dollars yeah yeah baby it's time to go you're a terrible player feel my power but up and away up and away on your bike thanks for watching don't forget to like subscribe share this with your friends until next time bye bye